now open your eyes. Let's try one more with you sitting up. All right, I gotta get going, but take your time. Okay, have a good flight. Good morning, passengers, and welcome to flight 999 all the way to little Los Angeles, a true flight of heaven. And thank you for flying with us at OMG Airlines. We will be cruising at an altitude of 40,000 feet above the weather. Once our altitude is reached, we will be turning off the seatbelt sign and you are free to deboard the plane. We will be waiting for you in the event that you want to get back on board, but please, do not go below the weather. Keep it above the clouds. In the very likely event of loss of cabin pressure, there is a halo hanging above you. And in the likely event of a water landing, there is a heart below your seat. If necessary, please begin with an E major to earn your wings. There is a piano available in the seat back tray in front of you. But please, no twinkles before takeoff. Exit signs are everywhere, all the time. You don't have to locate them. Main captain is Miss Lucy Cross and City Co-Pilot. you to please sit back, relax, and take flight. Shortly, we will be above the weather and only reachable to all that is holy. When I was a boy No rooftop on my joy Was not made of fire. One, two, three, four, five, six times the charm. Six, six, five, four.
Nothing here is sacred, dear. All things white. You're gone now for so long. You've grown up, child.
the crowd went dizzy, how the crowd went wild In you, my friend, you feel like fire As a speaker's boat, a soft sinatra Six is the devil, then nine must be the Lord. Tonight we'll be speaking with those who are questioning their faith and why. Let's take our first caller coming in from Little Los Angeles, Kansas. Caller, who are we speaking with? My name's Jacob. And what's going on, Jacob? Tell us what's on your mind. Well, recently I tried to pray, but I didn't know what to say. So I just mumbled some names and I said, I hope they're okay and amen. They were the names of my family and friends. Cause you know, the planet's so lonely and the planet's so cold. And if I'm so lucky, I suppose I'll die when I'm old. But I pray no disaster, no fire, no rain. And I pray that no devil gets inside my brain. As the world does its twirl between the moon and the sun, casting clock shadows beyond everyone. And the hours devour us. As I stare out my window, as I ride this bus. And man, it goes fast. And man, what a blur. But I'd write it the same, or oh, just as it were. Cause that feeling in my stomach when the light was low. And I'd get warm in my chest when my heart would slow. And that feeling in my head when the music played. Well, I'd get dizzy in my soul from the glad song they sang. I mean, what a dream to have ever felt the air so warm. And what a dream to have even ever been born. And oh my God. Pretty today, I gotta go though, and be on my way. But I'll be back, honey, that's a fact. With a laugh on my face and a guitar on my back, I make friends almost every single day. We talk a lot, man, cause there's a lot to say, but sometimes. I let my silence become the conversation And when there's nothing better we talk about the weather outside and I know it seems like screaming but man I'm only dreaming in time Savannah, has it been so long? But I'm back, babe. When there's nothing better, we talk about the weather outside. morning just open your eyes you've got a beautiful body and a beautiful mind oh my baby boys and girls you lived until you die congratulations 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 i go down to the station to the liver salutation to the travelers with patience oh congratulations
Hi, uh, welcome to I Want to Be Clean. Um, have you been here before? That was my first time. Okay, well, we got a two item menu. I'll explain it to you. Uh, first item here, this is today's special stop, drop, and roll doesn't work in hell, which, yeah, by Alexia, I wouldn't suggest. It's too spicy, and I swear to God, it lasts an eternity. Uh, second thing we got here, which is the last thing, because like I said, it's just a two-item menu. This is what we're famous for. This is our famous holy water. It's made right here, and I want to be clean every day. And it's really good, honestly. I think it might be just what you want. So, what will it be? Is there any way to get the holy water with ice? Yeah, of course you can. I'll have that. I'll have it right out. I can, can I ask you a question? For sure. Okay, well, don't be freaked out, but do you believe in guardian angels? Yeah, uh, no, I, I don't know. Um, I, I believe in people helping other people, things like that. Is that, is that what you mean? Okay, well, no, that's not what I mean. What I mean was, well, okay, my friend and I were having a debate the other day. She said that she believed in guardian angels, that they were walking around us, watching over us, and making sure that we were safe and that nothing bad happened to us. Well, what I was saying is that I think we're the angels. I mean, right? If there's angels, it's gotta be us. It's, we're all just a bunch of angels walking around looking for our halos. You know halos? Yellow you know, circles that hang above the angels. Let me ask you another question. You ever been on an airplane? Honestly, I think I'm on one right now. <laughs> yeah, I know you do. But I'm serious. Like a real airplane, you know, with, with a pilot and flight attendants, and you gotta have a ticket for it. Because this one time I was on a real airplane, there was this guy sitting across from me in the aisle. And he pulls out this green suitcase. He opens it up and there's a piano or an organ or something. It doesn't really matter what it was. What matters is that he had drawn this yellow halo on the suitcase. I noticed it when he was putting in the overhead bin. And I asked him, I said, hey, why you got a yellow halo painted on that suitcase? And you know what he tells me? He tells me he always paints a halo on his suitcase before he flies. So that when he puts it above him, it's like he's got this halo hovering over him. You know, it gets me thinking, what else is above you when you're flying on a plane? An oxygen mask. And what's an oxygen mask but a yellow circle, just like a halo, up there keeping you safe. So it gets me thinking about life preservers. You know, what they use in the unlikely event of a water landing. And I think to myself, well, what's a life preserver if not a yellow circle, too? Just like a halo. I know what you're thinking. A life preserver's below you, not above you. Maybe for you. But what about the thousands of people you're flying over with in the airplane? It's like it's giving them all a halo and they don't even know it. I know you think that's probably a stretch, but now that I said it, you'll see they're everywhere you look. Sometimes it's a clock tower. Sometimes it's an attic window. She sometimes a goddamn disco ball on a dance floor. Forgive me. But for real, you're gonna see them everywhere you go from now on. I promise. And you can thank me later. Yeah, sometimes I even think the moon and the sun are halos just looking over the whole world. Oh, okay, I'll stop rambling you. That's probably your order. Father, Son, Holy Ghost, amen. Well, go for it. Okay, okay. I understand you're nervous. I'll give you your privacy. Take a glad, 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 glad song and put it Red where it hurts 
and perhaps we'll meet again, my friend, above the weather. Will have gotten better Regardless of my fate, 